Hello, I'm from the government with an urgent message about the coronavirus. From Polish Productions. Some say it's no big deal. Italians are freaking out. The Chinese are hiding out. And Aussies seem to think the virus attacks your butthole. <laughs> to amateur videos. Coronavirus, baby. Coronavirus, baby. Humour is one way people in confinement are keeping up morale. Many of the world's comedy clubs are now closed. And it's certainly not a laughing matter that the livelihoods of thousands of artists and entertainers are in peril. When New York's live venues closed, the comedian Mark Normand hit the streets to tell gags to just about anybody. Corona beer sales have plummeted just because of the name similarity, which I don't get because when OJ killed his wife, I didn't stop drinking orange juice. I didn't stop drinking orange juice. Yeah. British comedian Matt Lucas is using laughs to share a more serious message, how to avoid the spread of the coronavirus. His video has been watched millions of times already. Keep some distance, make some space. Thank you, baked potato. Remember not to touch your face. Thank you, baked potato. If you want to have a better day, you must listen to what the baked potato say. An American comedian, Jim Gaffigan, is live streaming his family dinners on YouTube. So just about anyone can virtually have dinner with the comedian, his wife, and his five children. The idea is to help people cooped up at home feel less alone. It's dinner with the Gaffigans. Katie's on the piano. Mom is on her phone. I love you. Patrick's on. Michael's on. <laughs> and Dad's in a bad mood. 